You're watching the news from Bahrain Television. I'm Marie Claire. His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa issued order, Royal Order 41 for the year 2015, calling the representatives and Shura councils to convene for the opening of the second session of the fourth legislative term on October the 11th. His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa, the Supreme Commander, paid a visit today to the BDF headquarters. On arrival, His Majesty the King was received by BDF Commander-in-Chief Field Marshal Sheikh Khalifa bin Ahmed Al Khalifa and Chief of Staff Lieutenant General Diab bin Sakir Al Naimi, along with a number of senior officials. His Majesty the King was briefed on Duty Force One operations in Yemen by Royal Guards Commander Brigadier General Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and Commander of the Royal Guards Special Force Major Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa. The briefing included an explanation on the successful liberation of Marib and the full control of Bab al Mandab Strait by Duty Force One in participation with the National Yemeni Army and Resistance and the Saudi led Arab coalition in support of Yemen's legitimacy, security, and prosperity prosperity of its people. His Majesty the King praised the distinguished leadership of His Highness Sheikh Nasser and His Highness Sheikh Khalid of Duty Force One and expressed pride in their great achievements and sacrifices. He also asserted that the achievements of Duty Force One personnel reflect the excellence of the BDF affiliates and their high efficiency and determination to achieve victory in all tasks entrusted to them. His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa received a cable from BDF Commander in Chief Field Marshal Sheikh Khalifa, Sheikh Khalifa bin Ahmed Al Khalifa, in which he expressed congratulations to His Majesty the King on the return of the BDF officers who took part in the Arab coalition to liberate Yemen's Marib and retaking full control of Al Mandab Strait led by Commander of Royal Guards, His Highness Brigadier General Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and Commander of Royal Special Forces, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin, Major Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa. The BDF Commander-in-Chief confirmed all BDF officers and affiliates' commitment to their duties, stressing loyalty to the King and Bahrain. His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa received a cable from National Guard Chief Lieutenant General Sheikh Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa. The National Guard Chief extended sincere congratulations to His Majesty on the safe return of the brave BDF personnel after participating alongside the Arab coalition forces in liberating Marib and regaining full control of Bab al Mandab Strait in Yemen. Lieutenant General Sheikh Mohammed lauded the bravery and strong determination of the BDF personnel, led by Royal Guard Commander Brigadier General Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and the Royal Guard Special Force Commander Major Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, while performing their sacred duty and noting that they have set an example for Bahraini youth in enduring hardships and assuming patriotic duties. His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa received a cable from the Interior Minister, Lieutenant General Sheikh Rashid bin Abdullah Al Khalifa, in which he expressed thanks and appreciation to His Majesty for meeting the participating forces in Operation Decisive Storm and Operation Restoring Hope, 
as part of the Arab coalition to restore Yemen's legitimacy. He also thanked His Majesty for his pride in the participating force and for their sacrifices during their service there. The minister commended the honourable role of the kingdom in preserving the sovereignty of the country and its Arab identity, in addition to defending the interests of the nation. He expressed pride in the Bahrain Defence Force led and supported by His Majesty the King. The Interior Minister also expressed pride in the role of Commander of Royal Guards His Highness Brigadier General Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and Commander of Royal Special Forces His Highness Major Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, who became role models through their efficient participation in Operation Decisive Storm and Operation Restoring Hope in Yemen. On the occasion of the victorious comeback of BDF Duty Force One, His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, saluted the courage, bravery and sacrifices of Duty Force One, led by Royal Guard Commander Brigadier His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and Royal Guard Special Force Commander Major His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa. His Royal Highness affirmed the historic contingent's participation in with their brethren in Yemen's National Army, alongside the Saudi-led Arab coalition forces in liberating Aden, Marib and taking full control over Bab al-Mandab Strait, proves to the world that Bahrain has always been supportive of the right legitimacy and that Bahrain armed forces are ready to perform their noble duty with their brethren in the Arab coalition forces in defending the legitimacy in Yemen. He saluted Duty Force One commanders and personnel who performed their mission and whose accomplishments would proudly be inscribed in Bahrain's modern history because they present impeccable image of their country under the leadership of His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa. His Royal Highness expressed pride in Duty Force One commanders and personnel, like their brethren in the security agencies and National Guard, in safeguarding Bahrain's security and stability against conspiracies, and will always be present in the minds of all citizens who are loyal to Bahrain and its leadership.